I'm currently working in the Respiratory Institute. I work with the Lung Cancer Screening Program, and we also do lung nodule evaluation and treatment. So we see a large population of smokers, so we do a lot of smoking cessation counseling, and we screen individuals for lung cancer screening. Um, there are certain criteria for the program, and one of the biggest criteria is a smoking history. So the majority of our patients are smokers between the ages of 50 and 77. So there's a lot of psychological issues and um, challenges in patients who are trying to quit smoking. And so it's really important to identify what their habits are, what their reasoning for smoking is, and where they are in their smoking cessation journey. So it's really important to determine whether or not they're committed to quitting, and if not, what can I do to help them get to that final endpoint? Essentially, we are evaluating their risk for lung cancer and using some tools that stratify their risk, we decide if they need additional imaging or diagnostics. The lung nodule program is primarily made up of individuals who have had a diagnostic imaging within the Cleveland Clinic system and an incidental finding has occurred of a lung nodule. If a lung nodule proves itself to be concerning and we want to determine whether or not it could be an early lung cancer, then we do recommend additional diagnostics and additional uh, therapeutics. When it is a malignancy, it's also our job to inform the patient of that finding. And so a big part of my current role is having really tough discussions with patients about a new diagnosis of lung cancer and then guiding them through the next steps. We also have a large lung cancer survivorship program that's relatively um, newer. And so we also follow those patients through their lung cancer journey and afterwards for several years to make sure that we are meeting their needs, both from a respiratory standpoint and from a mental health standpoint. I am forming really strong relationships with these patients. I'm definitely seeing them at least once a year, if not more often. I treat patients the way I would want to be treated and the way I would want my family to be treated. My mother was a patient here at the Cleveland Clinic and received excellent care, and I was very proud of the way that she was treated here. And I strive to provide that same level of care for all of my patients. So I like to exercise, as most people um, in America like to do to decompress, but I also enjoy um, cooking. So I do a lot of cooking at home, spending time outdoors in the summer, of course, in Cleveland is amazing. 